Hi, we are here with a great interview with Jordy Alter, the president of the IAB. Jordy, how are you today? Good. All right. To be your chairman. Good. Thank you. We are in Scottsdale, and we're talking about Team Israel Baseball. So first, how did you get involved with Team Israel Baseball? So Jeremy, about six, almost 16 years ago, we made Aliyah from Fairlawn, New Jersey, and uh, we came with three older kids, 13, 10, and 3, and they were excellent athletes, really good ball players, and that was something that was really important to them, to get involved in baseball. So we made some phone calls, and I was told at the time there was no room for these kids to play, and they said, the only way you're going to play is if you agree to coach. So I said, okay, I'll coach. Didn't know much about coaching, but got my kid on the team, and that's how my journey started. That's how we sucker volunteers in at the synagogue, too. I'm well aware <laughs> of that. I've been, I've been down that road as well, trust me. So how does Team Israel Baseball fit into the whole IAB system, which is much larger than just the Olympic team going? Right. So for years and this is one of the one of the most exciting things for kids that get involved in baseball in Israel in general is they have an opportunity to participate in tournaments at all, throughout the world I've been with my kids to the Czech Republic to Italy to America amongst other places as well and it's one of the things that really gets the kids that really are serious about the sport involved and so that we've worked that up the ladder and Peter Kersen I would say 2011 had this dream to participate in the WBC and at that time he was the secretary general of the uh, of the IAB and you know we went along with this dream and you know uh, the story's been told uh, several times and I'm sure you know the whole story <laughs> but that sort of progressed to the WBC and then the dream for the Olympics so we fit the Olympics the WBC teams all the traveling teams the national teams the under 18 teams the senior national teams fit under our umbrella organization awesome so uh, now you've talked about going to all these other states, cities, but I know we want to eventually get these teams to come over to Israel too. So I know there's a big projects on the ground working to build fields. Tell us a little bit about them. Where are they going to be and how are we getting this done? Great. Thanks for asking. Um, so we have several projects on the, gr on the ground right now. One project is in Renana. It's going to be a combined soccer baseball field that the city of, Iria of, of Renana is doing in memory of Ezra Schwartz, who was yep. unfortunately... Uh, killed in 2016 in Gushetzion, while well, in Yeshiva at Ashrenu on a on a on a trip where they were doing Chesed. Right. Um, so we're memorializing that in his his, uh, his name. That field is currently being built, and we expect it to be completed this coming January. Wonderful. So that's really really exciting. Um, our sort of star project is in Beit Shemesh, yes. a project that I'm intimately involved in, um, and it's a project that we've started seven, six, seven years ago. And so we finally got all the Ishurim, all the um, permits and everything done. Um, we are finally building. Um, this is a project that we're doing in conjunction with JNF. That JNF has committed a million dollars to this project. Um, we still have another two million to go. And we're working with the Misrata Sport in Israel to try to help with some of the additional money, in addition to reaching out to fundraisers and here to try to raise the rest. But we expect that project to be done in a year. That's going to be a full baseball complex with training facilities, proper seating, proper locker rooms, and the ability to host international events as well as our own national events. And where can people donate? Uh, JNF Project Baseball um, is an easy find on Google. Um, we just set up a new page, it's easy to donate. You can donate there to the Olympic teams, as well as to any one of the projects going on in Israel. Or Nana, can be a chemist, and as well as Tel Aviv, we're also about to kick off a project there as well. Amazing. Jordy, thank you. Nice Appreciate to meet you, Jerry. Yeah. Mm.